You know, I think it's one of these places where people are real. Uh, you know, when uh, homelessness in particular, people have uh, reached a certain bottom in their life and there's no more charades and there's no more uh, false appearances. It's just they are who they are and they're here for a reason. They want to change. Change lives is what the whole premise is here. And uh, we're engaged in that daily and uh, just are delighted that uh, God makes those changes and we get to observe it and be a part of that process. There's a, just a love that permeates uh, what everybody does here. And that's, that's evident and I think it's contagious. And, and uh, you know, sort of the more you come, the more you want to come back. More and more discipleship has come to mean something a little bit different. It means not only uh, rescuing the person from the lifestyle or whatever the situation that sin has taken them into, but uh, it also means uh, preparing them for the life after the mission. If I'd have gone over there or I'd have had him at home, he wouldn't, we wouldn't have had to bury him the way we did. You know, I feel like I let him down by leaving him there. You find yourself still trying to make contact with them. You find yourself still trying to call them. This is a uh, more modern hymn based on Psalm 62. Father God, we thank you so much for this evening. Father, we're in awe of your son Jesus, who came and lived a perfect life. Everybody's very, very kind here. My first take on it was that I was gonna be trying to get out of here as fast as possible. I just, you know, it was a lot of rules and I just didn't think that it was a place for me. But I found out real quick that it's not like that. To have your own place, and have a full-time employment, and have the grace and mercy of the Lord, I mean, it's really, really peaceful. I ain't joking, it's peaceful. God said, feed my people. So I'm, I'm doing what he tells me to do. And I do it because of him, not because of me. Everything I do in life now, before I rededicated my life to God, it was all about me, but now it's not, it's all about him. You know, everything, my family, my friends, my work, everything I do is all about him.